An identified water source is a key part of every pre-plan. Most customers preload their hydrants, but anyone with a planner or admin role can also add, edit, and delete hydrants. To add a hydrant, zoom in on the map to the hydrant location, place the hand where you want the hydrant placed, right-click, and press Add Hydrant. The lat long coordinates and an approximate address will be automatically filled in. Review each field briefly and press Save. When the hydrant is added, it will automatically be color-coded based on NFPA standards from the GPM entered. To delete or edit a hydrant, right-click, then choose either Edit Hydrant or Delete Hydrant. When you finish tracing a structure, it will automatically select the closest hydrants that provide the required fire flow. These hydrants will light up on the screen to indicate they are linked to the selected pre-plan. You can edit these connections by clicking hydrants to select or deselect them. You'll notice the number of hydrants and total flow rate changes as the hydrants are added and removed. These hydrants will be identified every time you click on that pre-plan. They are also summarized on an individual and aggregate basis on the right menu. If you ever need to edit the connections again, simply edit the location and make your corrections. You can also retrace the building by hitting Replan, which will reselect the hydrants based on the latest required fire flow and hydrant locations. Finally, if the structure trace is wrong or needs to be redrawn for any reason during the replan, you will not lose your pictures or information.